A lot of activity continuing out in the tropics. Both of these storm systems could have an impact for us here in East Texas. We'll talk about Laura second. Let's talk first about tropical depression 14 uh, winds up to 35 miles an hour. It is still uh, to the southeast of the Yucatan Peninsula. It is expected to impact Cancun as a tropical storm move out into the Gulf late into the weekend early next week and possibly a category one hurricane as it makes landfall just to the southwest of Houston sometime late into the day on Tuesday, bringing some pretty heavy rain to Austin. Some of that rain could could move back around into East Texas Tuesday into Wednesday. A lot of the forecast models for this one uh, begin to show uh, slow drifting off to the west a little bit. Some of them still do have it coming up through Louisiana. Some have more of a significant impact here in East Texas, but I think Laura is going to be a bigger concern not only for Louisiana, uh, but for us here in East Texas. We'll show you why the blue boxes are tropical storm warnings as it is expected to have an impact unfortunately on Puerto Rico, Hispaniola and Cuba, but it should stay a tropical storm below hurricane status till it reaches out here into the eastern Gulf, and that looks like that's going to be on Tuesday. Latest models have shifted it southward, so it will not impact South Florida or the Florida Keys with a direct hit, according to the National Hurricane Center, but could impact New Orleans as a Category 1 hurricane on Wednesday. And then as we get into Thursday into Friday, watch where most of these models are going. A lot of them are heading up west of New Orleans, moving that storm system to bring heavy rain to us here in East Texas on Thursday and Friday, so we'll We'll have to definitely keep a very close eye on that. But in the meantime, it should be a beautiful weekend. We'll continue to track the tropics all weekend long here in the CBS 19 Weather Center.